Hey guys, what's up? George Payne here today, and today I've got a cool pod for you. And this pod comes to me from Ed Kohler, that's Naga Canario. And go check out his channel, the link will be in the description. Awesome guy, just an insane grower, grows some killer varietals, and he sent me this. Along with a lot of other pods too, but he sent me this one, this is going to be the first one that I'm going to do. This is a Savannah 7 Hybrid. Beautiful pod. Lots of bumpy texture going on here. Lots of wrinkles. Look at that. That's insane right there. That's cool. That end. It's like puckered up lips there. That's insane. But uh, I'm sure that this one is going to hurt quite a bit. Go check out Ed, though. He's a really awesome guy. And he was gracious enough to send me a box of pods. I'm really excited about what he sent me. Some really nasty stuff in there. And uh, this is the one he wanted me to do first. So I'm going to do it first. I'm going to oblige and do this. Um, I believe this is an F4 now. And it is a yellow 7-pot crossed with something. Um, I think it's unknown what it's crossed with. I, I don't know. Maybe, um, you know, if you know, leave me a comment. But I have no idea. I couldn't find anything on that. I do know it's an F4, though. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to cut this one open, tell you how it smells, taste, and give you the final verdict on the Savannah 7 Hybrid. Here we go. Oh, man, I'm really nervous about this one. I'm definitely going to save seeds to this one because I really want to grow this one out. And uh, this is one of Ed's hybrids that he has. Um, he created this. and I'm really excited about trying it. I've seen some horror stories with this pod. People just get wrecked. Look at that. Nice shiny wool on there. Put that down there. Let's open it up and see. Wow. There we go. Yeah, that looks uh, scary. That's for sure. Let me pull it in half real quick. There we go. Look at that. You see how much placenta is in this pod and how much oil. Good gosh. That is a freaky pod. Really scary looking. Lots of placenta just packed tight in there. Lots of oil. You can see the glimpses. Show you this other half. Definitely saving the seeds to this one. Lots of oil on that side as well. Placenta has a very nice color. It's almost like a uh, coral color going on. Lots of golden oil on the side. The sides of the pot are golden from all the oil. Let me grab some of the seeds from this. Oh man, oh man. Give me one second. Almost done. Hope everybody is enjoying their day. It's going to be a good one. Yep, here we go. Got some seeds. Wow, when you drop seeds on the paper towel that you're saving in and there's a streak of golden oil on the paper towel from one seed hitting it yeah you know you're in trouble and I'm already come to grips with this it's gonna hurt fair amount of seeds in this I can't even get to all of them without destroying the placenta or digging in the placenta so I'm only gonna get a few um, I'm gonna leave the rest in there as you can see just rake some of the seeds out there and uh, that's all I'm gonna get I got about 15 to 20 seeds. That'll be plenty enough for me to grow these out. I'm definitely growing these out though. This is an insane chili. Let's cut the stem cap off. Wow. I am freaked out about this one. Let's give it a good smell test real quick. Woo, woo, whoa. It smells extremely hot. I can already, my nose is starting to tingle from the oil. I guess I sucked in some of that oil when I was smelling it. It's got a floral smell to it. It does have a little interesting addition to the fragrance other than the floral. It might have a hint of sweetness. It definitely has that seven pot characteristic smell going on. Getting a hint of like freshness, like just crisp freshness, like almost like a lettuce smell. 
some really hot lettuce at that. But uh, here we go. Let's let's uh, go ahead and try it. This is the Savannah Seven Hybrid. Thank you, Ed, so much for sending this to me. Um, and I'm sure I'm going to be hurting here in a few seconds. Woo! That one hurts, bro. So much saliva. Mouth is trying to counteract that burn quite a bit. It's really pumping out the saliva. Tongue went. Oh, oh whoa. Floor pod too. Oh, my eyes are starting to water. It hurts. This one is a burner, boy. It's hot. It's hot, boy. I'm trying to fight through that. I'm, I'm like so trying to seek in a panic mode right now. I'm getting so red. My eyes are starting to water really bad. My mouth is really starting to saliva. Salivate really heavily. Getting really lightheaded. Getting really sweaty. Getting really hot. I kind of feel like I'm getting the shakes. <sighs> Flavor of this one, it had some floral notes and, it, and some bitterness, slight sweetness. <sighs> Sorry. <sighs> I really can't talk in this. Total mouth. Total mouth melt on this. It hurts so bad. Really deep burn, penetrating. The tongue's numb. The sides of the mouth, the lips are on fire. I feel like I'm having like a flushing sensation. I just feel like my body's flushing. It's hot. This is insane, boy. Yeah, I give the flavor of this one. Floral. Little bitterness from all the oil. It's got that capsaicin flavor. I give the heat of this one a 12. It's so hot. <coughs> and I give the flavor of this one a 5. I'll see you guys for the next podcast. Hissling is wrecked me. See you soon.